What is good, you guys? Today is Monday, and today is MP. What is, what is good, you guys? Today is Monday, and it's a great day for a tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to make drum programs. Yes, drum programs on the MPCX and in the MPC software. A lot of you guys ask me, how do I create drum programs and how do I get my drums up so fast? Well, I'm going to show you today. So let's get started with the tutorial. But before that, we got to roll the intro. Let's go. Bolo. Okay, first thing we need to do is have our MPC X turned on and we need to have it in standalone mode and we need to go to an empty project. Okay, now that we're in an empty project, we need to go down and put the samples in this first program right here, or any program, doesn't really matter. What we have to do is we have to get the samples. So let's go click on Browse. We click on Browse, we're going to go to Places right here, and then we're going to go into my USB drive, which I have some drums in here, but you can also load drums into your MPCX um, internally as well, but I'm gonna pull it off here for right now. So I'm going to drums, uh, what I got? I got a little trapping drum kit right here. Let me go right here to claps. Let me audition some of these. All right, I'm gonna load that clap. Uh, let me go to some kicks. I'm going to load that kick and let me go to some 808s. All right, I'm going to load that one. Okay, so I've had these loaded. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to assign these samples. So I'm going to click right here where it says sample assign. I'm going to click right here and I'm going to add my clap to it. I'm going to click right here onto this pad and I'm going to add my 808 right here and I'm going to click on this pad and I'm going to add my kick. All right. So let's go back into the main menu. And then now my program will have my clap, my kick, and my bass. So what am I going to do now? I'm going to save it. I'm going to name it. Um, I'm going to call this uh, drum test just for the video's sake. Do it and it's going to ask me to save current program or current sample. I'm going to save current program. So I already have some programs saved. So what you do is you would click on that and it would save the program and then now you have your own drum program made in the MPCX. It is that simple. Okay, guys, now we're going to learn how to put drum programs together on the MPC software. First thing we have to do is open up a new session. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go right here to this first drum program that's already assigned in here. And we're going to add some samples to it. So what we're going to do is, as you can see, I have some samples pulled up here on the side. I'm going to take this bass right here. And slide that onto the first pad. Uh, I need to have a clap, don't I? Let's slide that onto another pad. And then let me get a kick. And slide that one on right there. And basically, we are done. So when we play our pads, They're already assigned. So what we have to do now is we have to get this program a name, which we're going to rename it. I'm going to call this drum test. 
And then from there, we go to File, and then we go to Save Current Program. And once you click on that, you save it somewhere, you can find it. And then when you want to pull it up, you can just go right over here to where it says Programs, find out your location where it's in, and you pull it up, and I already have everything assigned to the pads where you had them at. It's that easy. Okay, there it is. A very quick and very simple tutorial that can help you out very, very, very much. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. Please comment and please turn on those post notifications so you will know when I have another video available. And like I always say, peace out.